Today we're here at Thurgood Marshall Elementary School in Fort Lauderdale. And we have over 100 volunteers who have joined us today for our signature Parkland Hearts event. And so today is really special because we were able to kick off our program um, with the remembrance ceremony. And also we were able to give back to Stand with Parkland today. So for every volunteer who has participated in the Parkland Hearts program, $25 was donated to Stand with Parkland. So. Uh, we were able to donate $5,000 to stand with Parkland for the work that they are doing uh, for safer schools in our community. Today is a labor of love for us. It's a commitment that we made five years ago to honor and remember those that we lost on February 14, 2018. I want to tell you a little bit about Stand With Parkland and how we have returned your kindness with action following our unthinkable loss. The donation from the volunteers to Stand With Parkland, the National Association of Families for Safe Schools, will allow us to continue our mission to change laws and policies to help keep our students and our teachers safe at school. We want to try and work through our grief. Best way to do that is through service and helping others. So as a community connector and a community organizer, this feels like the right place for us to be and doing the right thing. The special thing about a service project is that when we immerse ourselves in giving back to others, it's a way of connecting all of us. It's a way of sharing our humanity with one another, and it's a way of connecting the community in a way that probably couldn't be connected in any other way other than through service. And what we do is mobilize all of you to use all of that love in your heart and put it to good purpose. And so I couldn't thank all of you more for being here today to share your love with us, to share your love with Seattle Parkland, and to share your love with the students and faculty at Thurgood Marshall Elementary. Our sponsors. We could not have done this without you either. That would be the Miami Dolphins, the Florida Panthers, Comcast, thank you Comcast, and um, the uh, Leo Goodman Foundation. Comcast has been a supporter of ours for six, 15, 16 years. Thank you all to this day of love and this day of service and helping others heal through service. We feel like that's a really great way to connect with our community and stay in touch and never forget those that we lost on that day. Unfortunately, a tragic event got us all together. I do know that having this partnership and also having students, not just from Thurgood Marshall community, but students volunteering from throughout the community is building our overall community. I know my students, as well as the students that are visiting our campus are benefiting from this. Uh, all I can say is that I wish more of these type of events are occurring throughout the district, but not for a tragic event to occur. For our families, the families of the victims, it's wonderful to see the support that we get from the, all the volunteers at uh, Hands on Broward through this Parkland Hearts Project. So thank you very much. Grief is unfinished love. And so that's why this is important. 
because it is a day of love. And we hope that we can help with the grief and with the healing and feeling better.